hi virgo welcome back to my channel okay so this is your next 48 this is episode 28 and 29 for my virgos all right sun moon rising in the north node so let's see what the messages are for you virgo all right sun moon rising in the north node what are the messages please and thank you Virgo, sun, moon, rising. Okay, we have the three of pentacles, all right? So working something out, building a new foundation, your energy, Facebook, IG, Twitter, YouTube. We do have the tower card. So I'm getting all of a sudden something, something falls apart that you were building or you have to reconfigure or relaunch or something has to be reconfigured or rebuilt or re rethought through here. The, the, the third house is our communication house. It's, it's blogging. It's broadcasting. So you may have to do something over or relaunch something all of a sudden. Yeah, we have the six of pentacles, but I'm getting it's a good thing. A lot of pentacles coming out. So I'm getting it has a lot to do with your work, your business, what you're building or what you were building. I'm getting you have a lot of support of the people. People are supporting you. The heavens are supporting you. I'm getting people are patronizing your business. All right, people love what you're building. I'm getting people are very supportive of whatever you're building or whatever you're doing or whatever you're relaunching. People are on board with that shit. Yeah, we have the lover's card. Yeah, because I'm getting you love what you do. Now, this could be an actual lover or a Gemini. Someone's like, yeah, I love what you do. I love the idea, Virgo. It's a great idea. I want to support you. I, I'm in. I'm all, I'm all for it. What a great idea. Yeah, so I'm getting, I'm getting you are reconstructing something or relaunching something, rebuilding something, and people love that shit. It's a great idea. Yeah, we have the two of swords. You're feeling kind of impartial about it you're not really sure how to start or where to start how to rebuild this now this could be just like a blog or maybe you're starting up maybe you're uh reconstructing your ig page or you're starting a new ig page a new youtube something online you're starting something new you're like hmm so maybe it could be a, you could be building a website as well Okay, so I'm, I'm getting like you're setting up like PayPal on your website or you're, you're putting in links so that people can pay you or patronize you. You're just revamping something. Yeah, we have the Six of Swords. You could be planning a trip as well. I'm getting you're looking up, you know, like flights, rooms, things like that. Yeah, we have the Hangman. Okay, so you can't leave right away. Something is on hold or something is in suspense. I'm getting if you apply for something, you have to wait a couple days, maybe like six days. You have to wait six days before they get back to you, maybe three days, maybe 72 hours. So it's almost like you, you, you paid for something and now you have to wait. You have to wait for the green light. You have to wait for the go or you have to wait. I'm getting reservations. You're booking reservations or, you know, booking a room. You're not leaving right now, but you're leaving in a couple days or a couple weeks. Okay, so what is the uh, what is the hanged man? What is the hanged man? I'm also getting to somebody tried to move on from you, Virgo, and they got stuck. All right, somebody does not know what to do without you. Someone is kind of lost without you or someone does not. It's like someone doesn't know which way to go. Somebody keeps hitting a brick wall. Okay, what's the hangman? What is the hangman? I'm getting to somebody was supposed to help you build something, but they left you hanging to build it by yourself. Yeah, we have the King of Pentacles. Yeah, so it could be a Capricorn that left you hanging or this could have been a boss of yours. Maybe somebody was supposed to help you invest or someone was supposed to help you with this business, but they kind of left it up to you. You have to build it by yourself. But I'm getting you have a lot of support here from the public or from friends or from strangers. Okay, so I'm getting you have to wait until you have more money or, you know, it's going to take time for this to come together. We're going from the three of pentacles to the king of pentacles. I'm getting, I'm getting you are completely capable of building this by yourself from the ground up, from the three to the king. I'm getting you have built this by yourself. You've been working on this. I'm getting for like several months, six months to a year, and it's, it's turning out. It's, it's like you've had to wait. Okay, you've been through a lot. I'm getting a lot of people left you hanging, Virgo, but I'm getting the from the from the three to the king of pentacles. That's a huge leap. I'm getting you have I'm getting you are a self-made millionaire. Or you are definitely self. This is a self-made business that you have built from nothing. I'm getting you have I'm getting you had to make your own investments, put your own money in, your own time, effort, energy, blood, blood, sweat, and tears day in, day out. But I'm getting your business is booming. Okay, you've had to wait. I'm getting a whole year or maybe more. People left you hanging, you know, people betray your trust, people moved on, people fell off, but I'm getting you, you stuck in there and like, look at your business now, King of Pentacles, like, holy shit, you're going from the three to the king. Yeah, so I'm getting, your, I'm getting, you're going to figure this shit out. Maybe you don't know now, but I'm getting, give it a year or, you know, look at, look at, look at where you were last year. Look at where you are now. Like compare the two, like really look at your life and be grateful that you built this shit up. 
So yeah, I'm getting like you're sitting back looking like, wow, I really did this shit by myself. This is like beautiful. Yeah, I'm getting you can do it again. If you built one business, you can build another business and another one and another one and another one by yourself. You may not know how right now, but you will, you will figure it out. I'm getting you're being divinely guided to do this by yourself, maybe. Okay, let's go around again for you. I heard somebody say, once you're a millionaire, it's like riding a bike. You can always build another million dollars. It's nothing. All right, let's see. We have the Empress. Yeah. Okay, so we have the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, being self-made. And we have the Five of Pentacles. Yeah. I'm getting you may not have love, but I'm getting a lot of people turned their back on you, Virgo. A lot of lovers fell off. They betray your trust. Okay, people left you out on the cold. People left you to do things by yourself. People let you build this by yourself. I'm getting you could have went through homelessness, just feeling ostracized, feeling alone, feeling like nobody had your back, feeling like you were by yourself. I'm getting you were by yourself. I'm getting there, I'm getting there was definitely an absence of love here or intimacy do, during this whole ordeal but i'm getting virgo look at you now you are a fucking boss you're self-made i'm getting yourself made and it's only going to grow bigger you may not have love you may not have intimacy you may not have many friends or many connections because you're you're an entrepreneur people can't connect with you i'm getting you keep i'm getting it's going to be hard for you to find someone or find a soulmate but i'm getting you will you will find a connection. You will connect with someone, Virgo, someone who's just like you, someone who's beautiful, someone who's an entrepreneur, someone who knows how to grow a business. But I'm, I'm getting you may be lacking on the love department, but when, but when it comes to the rest of your life, you're doing very well. And I'm getting, of course, you feel lonely. It's lonely at the top because not many people are willing to work to get there. But I'm getting you are going to connect with someone. I'm getting also to you're being very vulnerable when it comes to love. You're putting yourself out there. You're letting it be known that, hey, I'm single. And I'm getting you're beautiful. You're, you're like gorgeous. The Empress? Yeah, I'm getting whatever you do. You're very creative. You are the best at what you do at that. The Empress and the Three of Pentacles, you are the best speaker. You have the best blog. You have the best channel. You get a lot of attention. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting you're, you're getting a lot of looks here, but nobody nobody is really tickling your fancy. But I'm getting people are very fond of you. All right, yeah, the Empress is very hard to impress. If you're the Empress, of course, it's not going to be too many people that catch your eye or get your attention. But I'm getting a lot of people try. We have the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, very successful, very wealthy. I'm getting your building wealth. I'm getting you're very professional about what you do. You love what you do. You love your work. You love your job. Okay, I'm getting you love the money. The money is very good. Yeah, we have the Ace of Wands. Yeah, you have a, I'm getting a new idea, a new business, another business, huh? Yeah, we have the Seven of Pentacles, the Seven of Swords. Yeah, planning, strategizing, moving in silence. All right, keeping everything to yourself. Yes, yeah, so, so I'm, I'm kind of getting like you kind of go behind the scenes and you just work and work and work and you just come out this boss at the end. Someone's like, damn, how'd you do that? Or how'd you build that? I thought you were homeless or I thought you were poor or I thought you didn't have anybody. I don't. I am homeless. I am poor, but I work. All right, whatever. What's the five of pentacles? What is the five of pentacles, please? I'm getting you are being blessed. So I'm getting like all your needs are going to be met regardless. You may not have intimacy. You may not have sex. You may not have love. You may not have a partner right now. That's just right now. This is only a 48 hour reading, but I'm getting you will. There is going to be new love in your life, new chemistry. I'm getting someone's going to come along. All right. And kind of like brighten your day. I'm getting to the, I'm getting, you need some sex Virgo with the, the ace of wands is my phallic card. Maybe like you need some sex. You need some TLC. You need to be hugged. You need somebody to touch you, kiss you, you know, sex you. I'm getting, you deserve some sex too, because you work really fucking hard is what I'm seeing. What's the ace? What's the five of pentacles? What's the five of pentacles? I'm getting like you rather masturbate though. I'm getting like you just masturbate and keep going and, and then go back to work. I'm getting you just don't have time. Like there's a lot of games and stuff. Yeah. So we have the we have the Queen of Wands, we have the Three of Wands, and we have the Magician coming out. So I'm getting somebody is watching you from a distance. Someone's like, wow, you are so attractive. Wow, you're so successful. Wow, I love your, I love your attitude. I love your personality. I just love you. You're just you're such a guru. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. What's the five of pentacles? What's the five of pentacles, please, for Virgo? Yeah, the Hierophant. Like I say, you're very well respected. Okay, you are a guru. You are a teacher. 
Okay, so maybe I'm getting too, maybe that's why people are very slow to approach you. It's you, it's very hard for you to fall in love with someone who's not spiritual, someone who's not, you know, someone who doesn't have their own business, someone who's not a teacher. It's very hard for you to fall in love with someone who does not have, who does not share the same beliefs or the same lifestyle or someone who cannot teach you. So that maybe you, maybe you are dating someone or you are like sleeping with someone, but they're not, they're just spiritually or mentally they're not it's not there for you if there's some type of void or i'm getting i'm getting you just can't have sex with anyone you have to have a connection first or you have to be mentally stimulated you can't just sleep around you can't just do that like it has to be someone who teaches you something or somebody who can actually bring value to your life okay so this could be a taurus maybe you are with a taurus but you're like you don't you don't do it for me or I, I feel void. I feel empty with you. I don't, I'm just not having my needs met or somebody, maybe somebody is just very bad at sex or somebody's very bad at intimacy or foreplay or something. That's what I'm getting. I'm getting you rather masturbate Virgo because someone is just, someone is just, does not do it for you. What's the Empress? What is the Empress please? Or someone just turns you off or someone just, they're just not it. Okay. What is the Empress? Let's go on again for you. Okay. Yeah, I'm, so I'm, I'm getting it's hard for you to make connections because people are just fake and phony and, you know, p maybe people are too religious for you. People are too, they too restrictive to buy the book. Yeah, we have the Ten of Cups, but you, you're very happy here. I'm getting you make people happy too. I'm, I'm also getting too Virgo. People support you more because you're single. I'm getting that kind of turns people on because you're single, you're beautiful, you're doing your own thing. It's like, maybe I'm getting too somebody's a beauty blogger. And someone's like, wow, I love her. She's single. She's beautiful. She's sexy. I really like her. I'm getting like, I'm getting a lot of your support comes from because you're single here. Yeah, we have the princess of, uh, yeah, the princess of pentacles. Yeah, building something from the, yeah, I'm getting you built your own business here. You work with your hands. You get, you get the job done. Okay, you don't make excuses. Yeah, I'm getting people look up to you. Like people want to be like you. Okay, what is the Ace of Wands? Yeah, the Four of Cups, yeah. But I, I'm getting something is not all it's cracked up to be. It's like, yeah, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. But I'm getting you're actually very bored and depressed behind closed doors because I'm getting you do want intimacy, Virgo. You do want, you do want a partner. You do want companionship. And you're just not finding it. I'm getting to you want something more. You want marriage. You want that, you want tradition, you want a traditional relationship, okay? You want someone that you really connect with, you have a bond with, a strong bond, a soulmate. But I'm getting you, I'm getting you, you just have no interest in anyone right now, or people just bore you, or it's just, it's just not exciting. You just, you want something that's exciting. You want some, you want someone that's going to sweep you off your feet, or someone who that you, that you have like a crazy connection with, something like a bond. You want a bond, I'm getting you want someone who's serious about relationships, someone who's serious about marriage, someone who's, you know, someone who's traditional, someone who's old fashioned. I'm getting that you want that. Yeah, we have the lover's card. Okay, I mean, we have the two of cups. So maybe you, I'm getting you made a connection maybe with an earth sign and it's really hard to find that again. It's hard to find someone who's grounded. It's hard to find someone who teaches you. It's hard to find someone who, who is so spiritual, someone who's, someone who's so respectable, someone who's so ad admirable. Yeah, I'm getting, the, I'm getting to the person that you're dealing with. They're, they could be very sneaky, a cheater, a liar, all right? Someone who lies about their feelings or someone who lies about their whereabouts or where they're going or what they're doing. I'm getting you, I'm getting you just can't trust this person, but you love them. They're, you have a very strong connection to them, but it's like, you know what? You do too much or you flirt too much or I'm getting like somebody does not respect the relationship though. Like somebody does love you. I'm getting somebody's very much in love with you. You're very much in love with them, but this person, they're not traditional. This person does not respect the relationship they're very easy to lie or step out or yeah, I'm getting like somebody, somebody doesn't have any discipline. Like they don't, they don't respect the union the way that you do. They don't respect marriage the way that you do, or they don't respect the marriage at all. Or they don't respect what you're building. I'm getting someone does not have any respect or someone does not appreciate you. So I'm getting you lost, you, you, you lost interest or you're losing interest. Okay, hangman, the king of pentacles. What's the hangman, the king of pentacles? 
I'm getting to somebody could be an impediment to your progress. So it's better that you just work by yourself. I'm getting you're happier alone. What is the what is the hangman and the king of pentacles, please? Yeah, the ten of swords. You have to end this. Yeah, I'm getting somebody betray your trust. Somebody stabs you in the back. Someone's a liar. Someone cheats on you like a lot. Or someone lies about how they feel. Or someone gives you mixed signals. All right, yeah, I'm getting something. Something is coming to a harsh ending here because I'm getting this. I'm getting this person has you on hold, or this person leaves you in suspense, or somebody like somebody really left you hanging on something here. I'm getting somebody was supposed to help you. Somebody was supposed to assist you in building this business, but they left you hanging to to do something else or to be with someone else. You could have been too independent for them, Virgo, and that could have been an issue. I'm getting somebody was somebody was lying about why somebody lied about why they left or why they pushed you away. It's because you were too independent. Or you, I'm getting like you were too skilled, maybe more skilled than they were. Somebody felt intimidated by your skills or by the respect that you were getting, the attention that you were getting. Somebody felt somebody felt intimidated by what you were building for yourself. Someone's yeah, I'm getting like somebody's not okay with you being self-made or having your own business or being beautiful, being independent, not really needing them. So, so I'm getting like somebody was lying and cheating on you anyways. I'm getting to, this is, this is someone who have, who would have turned their back on you anyways. This is someone who would have betrayed your trust. So I'm, I'm getting, it's a good thing that you got rid of them in the beginning because I'm getting, I'm getting this person would have, they would have destroyed the business anyways. Somebody is like a liar, a cheater, a thief, a backstabber. Okay, so let's pull some love cards. So I'm getting you. I'm getting you saw where this was, where, where it was going, and you put a stop to it. You cut them out of the business, or you cut them out because you saw that somebody was actually going. Somebody was trying to destroy what you were building here. Yeah, I'm getting like somebody was plotting on you, or somebody was sneaky behind your back and talking to other people while you were trying to build the business here. Yeah, somebody, it's like somebody was using your platform to like hurt you or betray you. All right, so let, let's just pull some love cards. So, but I'm getting you saw where, I'm getting you, you saw where it was going and you, you're going to put a stop to it. You're like, no, I can't do business with you. You're very unprofessional. You're a liar. You're a cheater. You're a thief. You're, you're, you know, you're not loyal. You're, you're going to end up, this person would have betrayed you, betrayed you anyways. All right. Let's pull some love cards. Yeah, we have retreat. Yeah, pull back. Yeah, so I'm getting you're going hermit mode or somebody pulled back. Because I'm getting, I'm getting you're going to keep growing. <laughs> so it, it doesn't even matter. All right, so I'm getting like somebody started something new with somebody else. Somebody chose somebody else over you or somebody chose, somebody chose love over building the business with you. But I'm getting now this person is bored and depressed with that new person. Yeah, something is over here. So, yeah, I'm getting retreat. Yeah, we have soulmate. We have let go of control. Yeah. I'm getting it's time to let this person go or you're letting them go. I'm getting like somebody thought the grass was greener, but now they're like suffering. All right. Somebody can't, somebody can't, somebody can't find that connection with anybody else. I'm getting to whoever this person is with. It's almost like somebody tried to take your place, but I'm getting it backfired. Somebody got stuck. Yeah, we have very soon. I'm getting some, this person may come back around. They may try to work with you again, or but I'm, but I'm getting like, you already know how this person operates. You already know how they do business. They cannot be trusted is what I'm seeing here. I'm getting too, like if somebody tries to hurt your business, they're going to be blocked. So this is why something ended. If something ended very abruptly, very harshly, I'm getting you were very much in love. It was very romantic, very intimate. You love this person, but I'm getting something just came to an abrupt end out of nowhere. It's because this person was going to destroy your business, Virgo, and the universe was actually protecting you and protecting your interests. I'm getting you were very naive to what this person was doing. But I'm getting, I'm getting the universe had your back. The universe, the universe was like, nah, fuck that. They, this person was blocked from being with you because they were, they had plans on destroying your business or destroying your reputation, destroying your character. I'm getting this person would have completely humiliated you too in the public eye by cheating on you and betraying your trust. 
All right, but I'm getting there is going to be new love in your life. Okay, so you can stop worrying, but I'm getting I'm getting something ended for like for your best good here. Somebody was like not to be trusted. Somebody would have completely destroyed everything that you built. Yeah, make the effort. All right, so I'm going to leave it there. Don't forget to like the video, leave your comments and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.